Hunger Clinic, fit and physical. I'm Jan and this is Michelle. We're here to help you do these exercises safely and effectively. These exercises should never cause pain or discomfort. If they are, please discontinue doing them and contact your provider. We also suggest you start these exercises with a light, low intensity warm up and end with a light, low intensity cool down. Let's get started and have some fun. Support yourself with your good arm as shown, keeping your knees slightly bent, bend forward at the waist, and let your bad arm hang down. Then make circles with your arm three to five times in one direction, then in the other direction. Start with small circles and gradually make them larger. Repeat five times twice a day. With the palm out, place the hand of your injured arm behind your back and reach up as high as possible, as though you were going to scratch your back with your thumb. Repeat five times twice a day. This is so rad. The back portion of the shoulder joint can be stretched out in this position by gently pulling your arm across your body as shown. Repeat five times twice a day. Standing with your arms close to your body and elbows bent to 90 degrees, hands pointing straight ahead, slowly move your arms so that your hands point out to the side. Lower your arms to your sides, then raise the injured arm overhead, helping with your other hand. Repeat five times twice per day. Girls just want to have fun. With elbows straight and thumbs turned toward the floor and arms about 30 degrees forward, slowly raise your arms to just below shoulder level. Slowly lower your arms to the starting position and repeat. Repeat five times twice a day. You're a rock star. Lie on your side as shown with injured shoulder up, holding elbow close against ribs. Slowly raise weight until it points to the ceiling, then lower to starting position. Keep it up! You're doing great! <laughs> 